What's up everyone? So I uh, wanted to uh, show you now how to actually set up a product. And as you can see here, we're in under funnels and uh, funnels and websites and funnels. And to set up a product, we actually need to click on one of our funnels and then go to products. If you click on this and you actually don't see any kind of Stripe uh, product here, then it's either it could be a few options. It could be that you have not set up your actual Stripe and I've linked that just below. Um, but it could be also that maybe you put in your API key wrong, either your product key, or, sorry, your public key or your secret key, or uh, you just haven't set up any products. So um, we're gonna go into our test account here. Uh, this is a uh, just a fresh account. And uh, all we're gonna do is um, we're gonna go to products. And as you can see here, we can add a new product. And I like to do monthly reoccurring just because one, that's how we are able to pull these Stripe accounts um, because we can just do one-time payments without having to add a Stripe and it's very easy. But if you wanna do a subscription model, then uh, you definitely wanna check this out. So uh, let's put in maybe uh, $999. And let's call this demo subscription. And we'll do this yearly. And because we're marketers, we always have to add a seven, right? Um, just kidding. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and save this product. And so what's gonna happen is uh, since we have this demo subscription, we need to refresh this page. It might take a little bit for the uh, website to pull up. So let's uh, see if we can get it up instantly. And now it's here, demo product. So we're gonna click that and then we're gonna save. But say we have uh, our demo product and we've already set that up. Um, we definitely want to name this demo product. Um, just 997 annually. And we'll just copy this. So now say for instance, we have a bump offer. Uh, we can definitely add that. So we'll go to products, we'll add new product, and we'll call this bump offer, just $1. And it'll be a one-time payment, so we won't worry about that. And then uh, we'll set the currency to USD, product price, just $1. Actually, $1. And then uh, we'll make sure that it's a bump product. So now we have our bump offer and we have our uh, regular offer. Um, we can also add things like uh, setting up it so that it uh, automatically applies to a membership. So if we have a membership program, um, which we'll go over in a later video, you can automatically assign them to that membership and they'll be sent an email with a um, login and password automatically. And then um, we can actually just assign that uh, membership program 997 USD, just one time payment of 997. Super awesome program. And then if we had a membership set up on this account, then we would do that. So, so you can have you can have all three of these, and they can pick and choose. So um, we actually need to take out that dollar sign. So uh, you can definitely set this up. So like for instance, when we save this, we go to the actual steps and the funnel overview, and la not launch it, but we add a two uh, step order form. So we go to elements, add element, and two step order form. Uh, 
and save this. All the info is gonna be in here. So uh, let's go preview. Actually, let's cut this down real quick. We're gonna turn this to off, off, off. Cool, and then we'll save this and then preview. And we'll just put our information here. So now we can see that they have just uh, 997 and just 997. And they can pick and choose which program they want. But say for instance, we wanna add that bump offer because uh, we actually don't have that in there. So all we'll do is go ahead and click on enable bump offer, add bump product, and that will be um, that bump offer right here. And then this is my awesome bump offer. Get your cool offer here. You don't want to miss this. And we'll just save that. And so by doing so, we'll just refresh this page. And again, we'll go Brandon, Brandon at test.com. And there it is. So uh, awesome, give my awesome bump offer. Uh, you don't wanna miss this and that's about it. So pretty easy to do. Um, and that is how you set up a product within Stripe.